are there opportunities to line you up outside uh, as well? Um, kind of take advantage of your speed? You know, it's whatever the coaches want to do. You know, I'm going to put myself in position to make plays, you know, if my number's called. You expect to see a lot of press coverage from them? I think we're going against a really good secondary, and they'll do whatever they need to do. Uh, what do you think of the, um, I mean, a lot of uh, Frank Wright was saying how when it gets to the playoff time, a lot of times you see defensive coordinators go in their band. Defense kind of go back to, to the basics there. Do you envision that they'll fight a little less of that cover three, a little bit more single high man? I think they have a good secondary over there that they're capable of playing, man. So you got to prepare for everything. So you got to prepare for man and then react as well. Guy said that Brent Selleck and the other guy spoke to the team about this opportunity. What, what did his speech in particular mean to you, knowing how long he's been here and how many times he's tried to get to this point? It means a lot. It means, you know, you got to be where your feet are and you got to, you know, you know, really, you know, enjoy that moment and take advantage of that opportunity. What do you expect it from this home crowd? All right, great energy. Great energy and a wonderful environment to play a football game. What would you say about Steve Sarkis? You know Yeah, great play calling, you know, I think he has uh, a lot of great concepts and, uh, you know, yeah, he's in his position for a reason. Did you like playing? I did. What did you like about his offense? I because mean, I think he, uh, he knows what he's doing. You know, he puts guys in position to be successful. Nelson, first playoff game. Have you dreamed of this moment? What are your thoughts going into it? Well, it's something you work all, all year for, you know, back in OTAs. You, you, you know, you work so hard to extend opportunities to keep playing this game that you love. You know, here is the first one in front of me, and, uh, you know, I want to leave it all out there. And, you know, you want to leave the game knowing that you did everything you can to leave victorious. Do you see many similarities between this defensive scheme and the Seattle one, which is basically, uh, you, know, uh, this, uh, you know, Dan Quinn came from there, basically brought it. To, uh, in a way, but, I mean, personnel is a little bit different. Yeah. So, in a way, they'll do what they, you know, what, you know, traditionally those defenses do. But then again, they have different players and they're capable of playing more man, in my opinion, and uh, we'll go from there.